Hi, welcome to the ASP.NET web form and entity framework learning by example project. Today in this video, I would like to show you how to work with the grid view and pedestrian feature. Okay, so we have done some pedestrian feature for news listing modules in this system. You can see here on the screen, we have a new listing. And in the first time, we load all of the news on this page. However, after we apply the pedestrian feature for this one, so now we are only display 10 records per page. And it seems the, uh, when the user go to this page and the layout look very good. Okay, so if, if the user want to view the older data, they click on the another page here. Yeah, okay. And on this page, we have the uh, we have worked with the repeater. I had a repeater to display the data here, and basically the repeater it does not support the feature for do pedestrian by default, and that's why we have to write the custom code to display the pedestrian feature on this page. Okay, so now I will open the manage news. There are the admin page. Okay, so on this page here, I has uh, I had used the the grid view to display the data for this page from database on this. And by default, the grid view it is support for some configuration to make the pedestrian feature work while work fine on this page. And in this video today, I will guide you how to do the configuration for this. Okay. You can see here, for now, we have 26 records of the news in the system. And at this time, we are display all of the record on this page. And of course, when you open this page, and you have to scroll down a lot of time here to view the latest, latest uh, record. In the future, when you are working in a, uh, uh, when this for example, when this website is published to the internet, so you uh, you have to enter a lot of data for news, and maybe in in the next month or some other month in the future, we have a lot of data here. For example, we have 1,000 records. So if you don't implement the feature to do the best thing for this one, and when the user when the admin go to the admin page and go to the news management here. So it will load 1000 record on this page. So we have something, we have two things. The first one is the loading perf the, the loading time to display 1000 record on this page will be, oh, it will take very long time. And the second thing is you have to scroll down, scroll down, and scroll down to see the record, and it is not good practice. Okay, so now open Visual Studio. I will open a new listing and uh, sorry, new management. There are new dot .ASPH. So now you can switch it to the design mode here. Okay, cool, and select the Read view. You could click on the F4 on the keyboard to open the property. Okay. Yeah. On the first, you can see we have a property allow pedestrian. By default, it is setting the phone. You select it too. Okay, cool. After you select allow pedestrian here, it will display the number at the, at the button, right button of the grid view. Okay. You scroll down here. We have a section in page setting. Yeah, in the page setting here, page setting. So we can do some of the configuration to display the the number of the I mean the style style for page feature on grid view. Okay, so the mode is you click on this one. If you select the numeric. It will only display the number, and I will select the numeric with first and last. 
okay and the page number count it then and we have another feature is page size here the page size here it means you can set how many items will be displaying on per page by default it will be set is a 10 10 item on a page i will have it by default save it okay so here you submit it to the event for the event we have to if when the user clicking on another page for example the user on the page one and they clicking on the page two we have to handle this action by manage it in the pet in the changing click double click on this one to create the action for this for this uh, other code behind double click yeah the code has been generated for pet in the changing action okay so here we i will update the code Read view dot pet index equal e e here this is the grid view pet event okay e dot new pet index okay meaning when the user clicking on another pet so it will create new index for for the new pet after that we have to rebinding the data into grid view binding data into grid view go to definition here zip method binding data cool save it and build it solution okay succeed so now i will open the browser and i try to refresh this one yeah scroll down okay you can see here instead of display own data e26 record for now it is only displaying 10 records on the first page page number one and click on page number two okay you can see here it will display the next 10 records on page number two and there is the order is 11 to 20 click on number three yeah 21 to 26 cool very cool We can change the certain sheet for to this laser data here. Better setting. Better setting. Number eight. Next and previous. Result three facts. Yeah, click, click, click. Okay. So we do the another survey. Numeric, numeric, numeric. Okay. Cool. So now, if you if think this one, the style sheet for pasting feature is here, it is not good. So you can write the custom style sheet to make it look better. Okay. 
you can you can follow the stasis correlation in another previous video and in this video i will have it by default for now okay so now i will open the menu product it should be the same for now we have 31 and I will open the product I close this one and I will copy this product design okay property allow passing should be 2 and Scroll down, better setting. It should be ten, and the mode is numeric and first plus. So with it to the event and click on the pet index changing. I will pet pet this one. Load data to grid view. Okay, same. Read data. Okay, cool. Be with again. Refat. Because we have thirty one records, so it should be have four pet after we do the patching here, and the last the last pet will be have one record. Yeah, correct. Okay. It's the same thing here. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to work with the grid view by do the configuration to display the pasting feature on the bed. Okay. Hope this video will be helpful for you and do let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye.